Fortunately, for almost every use, since there are now about 70 countries in the world that function perfectly well without asbestos present, their GDP hasn't been impacted. What we find is that there are substitute materials that do not carry the same health risks that function very well, particularly for the most common use of asbestos these days, which is the use in building materials, particularly uh, asbestos cement. As for myself, uh, I'm a physician trained both in internal medicine and occupational medicine, uh, but primarily I have studied and published over 100 peer-reviewed papers uh, on the subject of asbestos. I've studied it from uh, the effects on uh, cells and animals all the way to individual patients and populations of individuals. Uh, learning about asbestos has taught me that we have much preventable disease in the world and my hope for the future is that we manage exposure to hazardous materials like asbestos in a way that no longer makes people ill and leads to unnecessary deaths. things that I have learned in my many trips uh, to India is that asbestos containing materials are widely used. Unfortunately uh, here in India as in much of the world uh, the general population is not always educated about the potential hazards of asbestos. This is a material that need not be used. There are many safer substitute materials uh, and if the general public was better informed about asbestos and the potential hazards, uh, pressures would come in society to reduce the use of this material uh, and lead to a safer, healthier society, which is something we all would like. With regard to not only the general population, but uh, uh, even the uh, physicians and scientists in the society, both here and in India and in other parts of the world uh, are not uh, very well educated about the hazards of asbestos. Uh, in a small group of uh, individuals in any country there's knowledge and concern, but even among the uh, well educated uh, and, and those who uh, are concerned about issues in society, asbestos is not one that is often uh, appropriately appreciated. I'm hoping that over time here in India we can have some positive effect uh, with government officials because ultimately they uh, can make regulations and control or stop the use of asbestos. Control is not really something uh, possible. Uh, we've had some uh, successes over the years. Personally I've been engaged both in Brazil where there was active mining but uh, after hearings at the Supreme Court. Uh, the mining use and export of asbestos has been banned in that country. And similarly, it was uh, congressional action in Colombia, also in South America, uh, where uh, a mine was uh, to be closed, no longer was asbestos to be used in a society where much asbestos is present. So in some parts of the world, uh, not yet here in India, and unfortunately not yet in the United States where I live, uh, we have a product that uh, causes uh, disease and death that is still legal and uh, uh, potentially widely used, uh, but we continue to work in the spirit of public health to protect the health and well-being uh, of people in the society. concern uh, in a society of displacement when uh, a material uh, stops being used. One must be concerned about those who manufacture products or mine asbestos or put it in place 
fortunately for almost every use, since there are now about 70 countries in the world that function perfectly well without asbestos present, their GDP hasn't been impacted. What we find is that there are substitute materials that do not carry the same health risks that function very well, particularly for the most common use of asbestos these days, which is the use in building materials, particularly uh, asbestos cement. So substitutes are there. The workers who are engaged in manufacturing or uh, putting materials in place will still have jobs, but they will not be exposed to a hazardous material. They'll be working with a safer product. Ultimately, my hope uh, for India, for other countries, and for my own in America uh, is that we join uh, many other civilized countries in the world uh, to stop using this dangerous, uh, deadly material, uh, take care of workers that may be displaced, uh, which is not really a big problem, uh, and end up with a world that is ultimately healthier, safer, uh, and that uh, reduces one of the worries that we actually have some control over. Thank you.